Okay, that's working. Progression. Right. One moment. Uh. Let's have one more moment. Please. Please wait. Wait, I say. Easy, easy. Hold her. No, no, I said white. White, I said. Let me speak up. Hello, buddy. How are you, sir? Hello, George. George boy. How is the smoothness? How about now? How is it now? I've raised it to max. Barely hear me. Hmm. I don't know. I've put it on max volume on both my mic and uh, OBS. Let's have a look, shall we? Or maybe you're just deaf. Or maybe I'm just deaf. Hmm.
maybe I'll lower the game volume. Let's see. Let us see. I mean, there's nothing else to increase. I can only decrease. <coughs> uh, does that sound better? Does that sound better while I'm talking and shooting? Okay. Okay, okay. Let's -a go. I'm currently on Mars, and uh, we have a mission or a few missions up ahead. I need to place a sensor at the top of this tower. Right, that's it. Listen here, you. I can't get any louder. So, tell me about Mars. Well, sir. Mars is a planet that doesn't have much of an atmosphere that can contain life without extra external protection. And with that external protection, there is chat delay. Yes, I know that, mate. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Stay with the ship. Uh, Xenostar, we seem to have a problem. Ligma. Well... Let's see what the problem is with your Ligma. Oh. Hmm. Two days sprinting and no rest. You can really do a number on your bones, sir. Well, I'm just a good runner. Hmm. But there isn't much gravity. Surely that wouldn't affect as much as being on Earth. Musky cur what? No 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 no. I shower every day. With a wide variety of products that I cannot name. Oh damn it slow hill. towers and other theme parks are available Game developer of Only Up is taking the game down, isn't it? Because because of stress, so you won't be able to play that game anymore. In terms of purchasing it off Steam. Bollocks! Oh, I have to get up there. Oh, humbug! That's a wall. 
circumference of our square is equal to the scoops of balls that I eat cereal from. What? Super cooled magnet. Oh, ketamine. Know what? I'll make it even smoother. What? Oh, it's still on the 4K. I thought I'd change. Hang on, one moment. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. There we go. That should work. There we go. to put butter on. Don't worry, those are spaceships that keep coming in and out of this place. Oh my god! Oh, it's you. Don't worry, it's my companion. <laughs> uh, just a mild spook. It's what George does when he walks to mine. Although, that's been never... George, you need to walk to mine, man. All the way up north. Don't name drop my address. Well, actually, you can't have them. Oh. Come on, there we go. Quick save. I'm not going to do a Ben on Baldur's Gate 3. I'm going to quick save as often as I can. Yeah, go on then, George. I'll drop you off that mine. Then we can <laughs> knock that mine together. Not in that way though. Dirty bastard. Oh. Oh bollocks, fucking sloping. Up. Careful man. I was expecting a more difficult climb. Cheers, thank you. Thank you. It's a boost pack, mate, not a jet pack. You can only do little boosts. Okay. okay, I will, George. Ooh. Next mission. Oh, bollocks. I have to enter that cave. Wait. 
where is it? Oh, almost died. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, bollocks. Yeah, well, at least I can avoid the Sarlacc pit. I think you need to, like, get a certain skill to make it into a jetpack. Possibly. Shame there's no vehicles you can use to traverse the planetary surface. But, I can do a Peter and drug up. There we go. So we got a fast boost. Skeeter Peven's on the run. Well, at least I'm an unskilled spaceman. Unlike you, unskilled man. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> Bermuda cut. Bollocks. Oh, you're in there. Oh, is that plutonium? Thank you, sir. Oh. Nabby, ah. nabby, nabby, nabby. Some nickel. Nah, just to unlock the skill where you can't die. Mining as I go, deeper we go. <laughs> we took all of Alex's gold. What now? Oh my! Oh, it's two there are. Should be able to put the larger pot. <laughs> oh, time for stew. Oh, it might not work because of the helmet, but it does work like in a city. Oh, 
from all day. You won't sue me. You won't sue me. Oh, there's blood. Oh, Kimochi, what's happened? He gets. Oh, thank you for that plutonium. Dead end. Typical. Came here for fucking shootout. Out of my way. I'm getting out of this fort with or without that dragon. You gotta escape Helden. I am a dwarf. And all follows. Are you a UC Marine? Nah. But boys, two there are. actual dead end now. Oh no. What was that? I heard that. Oh there's more up there. Jeez. That must be an exit. Search for mineral deposits while we're down here. Uh, yeah, this is a really good gun. Can one shot most things? My favorite is doing the old Georgian space. <laughs> Got my trusty sidearm. Oh, great. Let's do it. <clears throat> Tactical mining. Oh, boy. I did screw that up. Alright, sir. Is this type of gun? <coughs> what gun is it, George?
Contraband. Well, crap. Eight of them. Learn to pick them. You know what? On second thought, I don't want to know. I need to sell that contraband. Otherwise, I'm gonna get thrown into jail by the UC. When I was living on Mars, I'd spend the weekends exploring caves just like this one. Nice. to go and do oh. well partially explored oh, I can't have that can I good lord went to prison. I can't go again. I got done in for harvested organs last time. experience because I'd say you are POV you're George and you find out Alex is going Tesco I'm coming Graceful crossing. What ship is this?
Oh, time to see what's in here. So, these little features are just lovely. Hmm. Perhaps we should help Dennis and clear these things out. Pest control. Are you a space trucker? Poor guy. Have some toast, some butter. There's another toast. Can you let me in? What's that, sir? I hear heat leeches. Thank you. What an oblivion is that? Oh my god! It's hunting season and looting season and how many doors are there? Hands where I can see them. Oh my god. Oh, the second one. Just money. Oh. Hello? Hello? in here. I just want a friendly game of going to Tesco's. You're in here, bud. Buddy. Hello. As you root around the contents of the container, noting some ruined consumer goods inside, a heat leech. Oh no. Great. Everything's good in that. Should be dead. Have at me. Come on, bring them all out. Work them out. Got another one. I'll reload the gun however I want, mate. I'll reload after one shot. This is gonna end badly for you. Oh, beautiful. What?
my maths is over the limit. Hmm. We can have some tofu. Oh, clusters. Heading to Sidonia, which is on Mars. Place that sensor and my mark is as good as dead. Good. I'm already getting readings from it. Nothing yet, but when he shows, we'll get him. Here's your pay. Think of it as your cut of the bounty for your assistance. Thanks for the love, thing. You did not find my cargo ship yet, I take it? Oh, no! I hope they did not get into my cargo and ruin anything. As for the crew, I assume dead, yes? That is too bad. Too, too bad. But you found the ship and its cargo, and that is good at least. I will send someone to retrieve it now that you made it safe. Thank you. Maybe I will have more jobs for you, if you want. Uh. I heard hey, Fredo. Got any special <laughs> goods you're willing to buy? Ah, plenty. Oh, wait. You mean more work from me for you? As a matter of fact, I do. You know how I have that shh, -shh business on the side? Well, I could use some help acquiring more goods to sell. How would you feel about obtaining them for me? Or oh, just dandy. Well, I can't say for sure. I doubt these people will give their equipment over willingly, you see. But maybe... Well, you seem the clever type. Maybe you can get in and out with no notice and they will never know. Of course, I can't say for sure. My body only tells me where to find them, not how to get what I need. These items wouldn't happen to be illegal, would they? No, no. Well, they may not be entirely legitimate, but I assure you, they're not exactly illegal either. You'll be obtaining equipment from renegades, enemies of the settled systems. So really, you're doing everyone a favor. Sure. <laughs> Excellent, friendo. I have a buddy who gives me information on where to find renegades throughout the stars. And I will give this information to you. You will go there and get the items I need from them. One thing, though. I don't want to hear details on how you get them. But you will likely need to use force, so be careful. And try not to damage the merchandise. Hmm. You and me, friendo. Stick together and we're going to make it big someday. You'll see. So what's the difference between a buddy and a friendo exactly? Hey, how to explain without making offense? Friendo is more for people I do not know, but wish to know better, like a customer or someone like you. 
A buddy is someone I know for a long time. Maybe one day you will be my buddy when I tell others about you. But it takes some time. Take a look! Oh yes, I could sell this contraband to him. Okay. Although I can only sell two at the moment. See you later, Fredo. I just think I need to go all in. I don't want to waste my time struggling. Used to think I was Vanguard material. All residents are welcome and encouraged to make use of the Sidonia Community Center on the mid-level for activities of all sorts. Seek a Community Center representative to plan your event or regular gathering. That could work, since I'm on Mars. choices. Something for me? Don't start that crap with me. I'm in no mood. Did you bring me the money Fielding owes me, or do I need to pay him a visit myself? Uh, when you leave, Dylan. There, would you look at that? I knew that bum was holding out on me. He going to be a problem anymore? Or did he get the message? Nice! You're kind of a natural at this. Leaning on deadbeats comes easy to you. I like that. Well, you know, when you're with if you Dylan. like this kind of work, I can get you more. A lot more. You think you can handle running with my, uh, associates? Who exactly are your associates? If you haven't figured that out by now, then maybe you aren't cut out for our line of work. Well... If you think they can handle me. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I like your style. All right. I'll call ahead and get a hold of Neva Mora. She's second to the big boss himself. Head out to Europa. You'll find her there. 
I suggest you listen to whatever she has to say. Oh, and I've taken care of that Aurora shipment for you too. Don't spend all that cash in one place. Venus? Fairfield, ha ha, I get it. Getting this equipment, just that I might. Oh, come on, mate, I really wanna. You know what? I'm just gonna get rid of it. Take it all. Just take it all. Be safe out there. Caution. Subterranean particle detonation imminent. Only one point of Moera's patrol route to work from. That's how it goes. Bye for now. Keep a lookout. Notify us. my ship I beefed it up with a lot of compartments it not be Jemison but this ship is starting to feel like home how dare you it's nice to see you down again. I think streaming it causes the frames to drop. That seems to be a lot better though. Right. I'm your Venus. Go kick Sovereign's ass. Stay in orbit or jump. Your call. Cool. Mars Mech Factory. Okay. Go. Europa. Find the berry mule. Actually, I could do that one. Set course. Into course. to speak with Eric. He's indisposed. You're speaking with Captain Gustavo Valencia. 
What's that? We are mercenaries. We get paid to solve problems no one else wants to take up. Much like yourself, I imagine. No trouble here. close enough. Better think twice before starting trouble. What exactly do you want here? Well, cool. I don't want trouble either. Yeah. And what do you have to say about it? We're getting paid to deliver it back to the trifle owner, and I don't think that's you. I swear, it's... it's like I said! That's Jane's ship! I I, 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 I was there when she bought it! Hey, shut up and let the adults talk. Now, where were we before this interruption? It's not green, mate. We don't make mistakes. Our employer is very reputable. The ship matches the detailed description we got. We know we've got the right one. Look, it's possible there's more to this. Maybe someone else stole it, offloaded it, and your friend bought it. Sorry, but them's the breaks. We're doing our job here. So, unless you've got something else to propose, we'll be taking this ship in. Our employer will handle the pilot. I'm not convinced this is a good idea. Well, this is just another ship to my client. They can afford to take the loss on this one. You know what? Fine. I'll tell our guy the ship's gone. We get paid either way. This ain't worth the trouble. Just be extra careful out there. If my client ever finds out the truth, we may meet again. And I won't be so cordial. Though I hate the fact that we had to strike a deal with Ecliptic. At the end of the day, you did it to help Jane. Job well done. You can untie your pilot and let him take the damn ship. I'm done. Thanks. I... I thought that was gonna be it for me. I can't believe you worked out that deal. Jane's gonna be happy to get her ship back. They said they'd been looking for this ship for months, ever since it was reported stolen. I don't know who it belonged to, but they clearly wanted it back bad enough to call Mercs, not Sistef. Must have had some way of tracking it. Followed me from Mars until we were nowhere near Sistef, I guess? Or just my own bad luck. I was just about to write the whole thing off as a loss, but damn, you pulled it off! I guess I'll stay here with these guys until their ship returns, and I'll meet you back at Jane's. I still can't believe what happened. Well, I'm gonna have trouble sleeping tonight. Come on, do what you have to do. Stop messing around and get out of here.
scenery. Separation complete. Actually, haven't tested it in space battle yet. I've just kept like changing my ship up each time. No idea. They appear and attack people seemingly at random. House Varun technically has diplomatic ties to the other factions, but the Zealots are outside of their control. Or so they say. No, but I think I see something else that might. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it, we could download its logs and figure out where our vanguard was heading to next. <laughs> opening for our... Exactly. Minimal ship power. Go slow. We grab the data on that satellite and jump away. That's the key. That he learned the truth of the shrouding, the coming eternal embrace. That you will reward the promised and cast the accursed into shadow. Oh, it's right there. It's right there, but I'll go behind this. Massive heap of asteroid. Stage two Ligbert active. Eat them. 
hearts. Why is that, mate? <laughs> Heartless cur. Alright, let's, let's get ourselves some nollocks. Cheers, cheers for the hearts. is there but it's a dust bowl again. Hello, Captain. Steps in and we're already looking at a corpse. Okay, it's not Vanguard Moara. Looks like spacers were scavenging around here and someone else came in and said hello. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with a spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Fleet.
gonna make you pay. Well, that's that. guys playing the long game. Call that sissy talk. Stars, he's dead, and our artifacts. 
Fab's gone. We're going to have to board. Target the engines. Once they stall out, we'll have our chance. I just boarded the ship. Am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? Ecliptic mercs. They'll work for anyone. And vanguards don't exactly make friends with local pirates, thieves, and scavengers. I think enough of them finally got fed up and they pulled their money to hire professionals. What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories, too, about a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is. I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? Oh, that. Yeah, I mean, it's been a mess lately. Spacers, Varun Zealots, plus Ecliptic tracking me down. We ran into a few members of Ecliptic at the Nova Galactic Star Yard. I'm guessing they were after you. Ah, damn. That's probably how they found me. I knew taunting the Spacers to meet me at Neptune was a long shot. Making rookie mistakes. I've been chasing shadows around the Sol system for years. And every time I go back to Mars... Sidonia is waiting for you. Run down. Forgotten. Feels like everyone's given up, you know? I've just been spending more and more time in the Starfield, 
Sometimes I wonder if I'm really going back. Yeah, it sure does. Guess someone needs to be out there keeping the old neighborhood safe. If you're ever in Sidonia, we should grab a beer sometime. If you don't mind, we came here for something. That strange object you found? Right. Hey, it's yours. Appreciate the rescue. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Thanks again for the rescue. Don't know what I would have done if you hadn't jumped in. Ready to lift off when you are, Captain. What's the news? So what happened? Who took it? It was stolen? Oh, jeez. I guess it really was too good to be true when I bought it. Anyway, I'm super glad you found my ship and saved Eric. It's more than I could have hoped. I'm glad I asked you instead of relying on Sistef. I never would have seen the Berry Mule again if I did that. Oh, I mean, I knew the deal I got on it was too good to be true, instincts be damned. I probably should have thought about it more, but I had to jump on the offer because my business means everything to me. Guess I know better now. Well, first of all, I'm gonna count myself lucky. Then, I'm gonna continue building this business. Now that I've got a functioning cargo ship and a pilot, can really start to bring in some good merchandise. You've done me a real solid here. There's really nothing I can do to fully repay you for what you did. Here's what I can afford to pay you. And on top of that, I'll see what I can do to lower the price of anything you want to buy from me. Thanks again. Oh, thanks again for getting my ship back. Let me... Well, you got the ship back, and I think I'm just gonna lay low for a bit, just in case. Oh, to be honest, I'm a little spooked by the ordeal. I don't have to start over from scratch, and, and that's great. So, thank you, again. As soon as we're ready, Eric will be back to making runs, and hopefully, he'll have learned a thing or two. Maybe I'll even upgrade the Berry Mule with more defenses. Might not be a bad idea, you know, just in case. Sure thing. Take a look.
goodness. We're still here. Yeah, bye. A strong community is stronger than any higher power. service, Captain. When humanity finally left the cradle of Earth behind, the United Colonies was born. Intrepid explorers and valiant colonists used Deimos starships to venture into space. When the U.S.C. I, I wish Deimos was exclusively a military contractor. Deimos ships are responsible for... Deimos builds some of the toughest ships in the settled systems. That's probably why the UC Navy continues to contract with them to this day. the ship can hold a candle to a Deimos. It's not even close. Welcome to Deimos. This is the heart of the UC. What do we have here? A civilian in my star yard. Deimos prides itself on being the UC's first and last line of defense in space. Hello, But we're welcome. more than happy to protect and arm bold entrepreneurs that do their business among the stars. Deimos is the pride of the UC, and it is my privilege to welcome you. So, let's see about getting you a proper ship, one worthy of you. Yes, they are. 
I flew my longsword in 43 combat missions. It never once failed me. That's what you get with Deimos. Our ships have been battle-tested for decades longer than anyone else. I've had a long and successful military career. Deimos starships have played a major part in it. In fact, I'm sure that if I flew any lesser starship, I probably wouldn't be standing here right now talking to you. That's what Deimos affords you. The confidence to go soaring into the fire, the death, and know that you will make it out alive. Then you'll love the ships we have on offer. If you ever get into a combat situation, your enemies won't know what hit them. And that's the way it should be. Music to my ears. When you get serious about your spacecraft, come back to Deimos. Use that feeling of sitting in the cockpit of a long sword. There's nothing. Wrong. These are hallowed halls. Shake course. This is Mars. United Colony Space. Maintain current course while we scan for contraband. And we're done. Welcome to Mars. Mars do 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 gonna make sure you get that job okay now we need to ensure you get hired basically we'll need to make sure you're the only choice to do that you'll need to get access to the HR terminal in the corporate office upstairs on the main level if you delete the other applications from the system you'll be a shoe in believe me if you knew Tia you wouldn't worry I'll be honest, she's so overworked and behind in her tasks that I don't even think she knows there are any applications. That's a good point, though. Once your application is in, I'll ping her and ask her to take a look to see if any applications came in for me. That should get her to finally take a look. See yours, and if all goes well, she'll hire you on the spot. I happen to know that the HR director, Tia, and the other women in the office tend to go to the Broken Spear for happy hour at five every evening. That's your window of opportunity. That's the spirit? Believe me, this is gonna help everyone. By the way, the HR password is password spelled backwards, which Tia thinks is pretty clever. 
She gets talkative during happy hour, and loud. I'm surprised everyone doesn't know her password, honestly. Anyway, should be pretty easy. Good luck. Continued success is my life's work. At least I've got more than enough work to complete before go to your I can happy go hour. home. <laughs> Unless you're a Demos employee, I can't really help you. Something to do around here. Drink the night away. Thank you. Goodbye. that throwing litter off the balconies is prohibited. Please use an authorized waste receptacle. Trust me, this is the best shot we've got at getting that request approved. And I can say that I've got some good news for you. I just saw the company message go out that you've been hired as Peter's assistant. <laughs> Congratulations. Not really, and neither should you. Either those applications were old and those people have moved on, or as soon as you disappear after this, they'll get to hiring again. They won't. I'll tell you a little secret. No one really cares too much. I'm not saying anyone's bad at their job, just that everyone's too busy and overworked to care. Seriously, no worries, mate. I've been here long enough to know how they operate up there. Next step should be easy. Just go to work for Peter, and when you get access to his terminal messages, you'll see my request. All you've got to do is approve that request, and we'll be right on with it. Then, we can get that new equipment 
and show corporate how it's done. It's amazing how smoothly our mining operations run with me in charge. I can't recall the last time we've had any major issues. Oh, you, you're finally back. I feel like you've been gone for ages. Do you know how tough this job is without an assistant? Good. Now, let's make... You look a bit different than I remembered. Did you go to Enhance? No, now I remember. They told me they sent me someone new. Anyway, when they told me how poorly you did on your application questions, I had my doubts. But at least you showed up on time, so maybe there's hope? Well enough, Chit Chat. Let's get to work. Not quite. I need you to do something much more important before you get to that. I'm expecting a personal shipment. I'm not sure why, but the last time this happened, my assistant ended up speaking to Governor Hurst about it. Now, run off and get it for me. What's in the shipment? A good assistant knows it's not their place to ask. Bad assistants get fired. Mediocre assistants get... You know what? I forgot where I was going with this, but it doesn't matter. Just get it for me, will you? Also, I don't quite remember. But it is important, that I know. I could, but we'd be wasting valuable time, so no. Oh, do they cover nothing in orientation anymore? No, strike that. We got rid of orientation, didn't we? Anyway, it's not important. Your job is easy. You do what I ask, and that's pretty much it. I'm surprised you've forgotten that steer. All right, uh, new assistant. <laughs> I keep forgetting. I don't know. At first I thought I had multiple assistants that rotated in and out, but uh, it seems I've only ever had one at a time, and they all just stopped showing up. I believe my last assistant was supposed to get me some coffee, but never came back. I honestly wasn't listening to whatever they were crying about. Oh! You're done? Live where you work. Tired of commuting from distant systems to Sedonia every day? Lux condominiums have three levels. Careful near the railings on the upper levels. Whether you need The Sedonian people are great. Well then, you've been quite busy making a name for yourself, haven't you? Heard of you. Of course, how could I not? Interesting. It appears Governor Hurst is well aware of our exploits. If by exploits, you mean what your friend is doing for Sidonia, and not your work for Constellation, Ms. Morgan, you're right on the money. So look, I admire a go-getter like yourself. You're not in trouble, unless you make trouble. And I don't think you're the type. I know you're not really Mr. Brennan's assistant. I don't know exactly what you're up to, but I have little reason to suspect you're up to no good. So let's cut to brass tacks. What can I do for you? Oh, I know exactly what happened to that shipment. However, I suspect Mr. Brennan neglected to tell you that I'm holding it due to his immense backlog of unpaid taxes. Then again, he may be unaware. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll release that shipment for you. But I'm going to need a favor first, since you seem to be adept at keeping quiet. See, my personal spacecraft was stolen, likely by Crimson Fleet pirates. I need someone to find it. Then I need that someone to destroy it, discreetly. I need tight lips on this. 
Well, this is a tricky situation indeed. Not to get bogged down in details, but assuming this is the work of pirates, it's best to destroy the ship and everybody on board. Makes it cleaner for insurance purposes. Oh, it's a, a few reasons. I don't want this mired in their process. Also, it's a bit of an embarrassment for a sitting governor to lose a ship, so I'd rather that not get out. I'm sure you understand. Then we have an agreement. I'll send you to the ship's last known location. Remember, not a word of this leaves this room. Some extra 
ship parts for repairs, because we're going to need it to get this thing back to base. What are you waiting for? You already got an invitation to board. I hope what they're carrying is worth all this trouble. So, you're a pirate? Please. We know you're not really with the fleet. Word of advice? Learn the lingo before you attempt anything so stupid again. You've got two choices. We need ship parts to repair our busted craft drive. Hand them over along with your ship, and maybe we'll let you live. Or we dust you and take it anyway. You've got to the count of 20 before I make that choice for you. You mean to parlay? <laughs> Countdown's over. Consider my curiosity peaked. Could have, but didn't. That might be a fatal mistake for you. You're clearly bluffing. No one would be that crazy. Hold on. I'm trying to figure out how we can walk this. That's where you're wrong. Is that it then? Sorry. Nothing personal. But we need a ship. And I don't care about your damn mission. But I'll marry your gal. Tell you what, I'm feeling charitable. Just give us the ship parts we need to repair our craft drive so we can get out of here. And uh, I'll let you live. I'll admire your confidence. We'll be sure to set your corpse afloat towards someplace nice. Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest. and shine. We've got things to do.
Welcome to UC Space. Maintain your current course while we scan your ship's cargo. Scan complete. Welcome to Mars. You are clear to... Mars, eh? You always take me to the nicest places. I don't miss the war, but I do. That's a pretty serious accusation. I assume you have proof of these alleged illicit activities? Hmm. Let me take a look at that. Well, this doesn't look good for Hearst. I'll say that. You did the right thing by coming to me. I'll take it from here. The United Colonies thanks you for your vigilance. For doing the right thing? No. This action benefits the entire city. The reward is that we get justice against a corrupt politician. Tell you what, I'll do you a favor. Go ahead and finish whatever deal you had with Hearst. I'll wait to take care of him until after that. Just don't let him know we spoke about this. I don't want him running, and you don't want to lose whatever leverage you've got with him. I can tell you, Sidonia appreciates it. Stay away from the Sixth Circle on this road. What a day, huh? Crime's at an all-time low around in Sidonia. Let's keep it that way. I sure hope you've taken care of our little... Did you, uh, take care of my little problem? Period. Now I want to look up every word in the dictionary to make sure this doesn't happen. I'm already giving you what you want, per our agreement. Hmm. Tell you what, here's a little extra to keep you happy. But you should know, if I hear any rumors about this, I'll know exactly who to hold accountable. Don't get greedy. I'm willing to resolve this amicably. I suggest you do the same. Good. I'll release Mr. Brennan's shipment to you as promised. I'll even defer his taxes as a little bonus. You really helped me out of this bind. <laughs> Don't take this the wrong way, but I hope I'm never in need of your help like this again. Word to the wine. Sorry, we have to cut this conversation short. Keep a lookout. Notify us if you see anything suspicious. Sometimes I feel like these mines just run themselves. <laughs> I like to think that's thanks to me. My shipment. Oh, I'm sure it is. Anyway, can you get to my messages? They're always such a pain to manage, but with you answering them for me, it'll be easy. <laughs> oh, use my password, and try to make my replies sound like me, you know. So people think it's me, even though it's not. <laughs> yeah.
10 days off per calendar year. Oof. Easy at the moment. Taking Hank so long. I saw. Take care. <laughs> Good work. See? I knew having someone on the inside like that would work out. I've already put it in order for the equipment. I was going to ask you to pick it up for me, but there's a problem. One of my guys, Hank Ferraro, offered to go. I tried to tell him he'd be more useful sticking to his job here, but he insisted, and he was already on his way out before I could stop him. But. <sighs> It shouldn't be taking this long. Just a quick trip to Gagarin and back. I'm concerned. I could use some help with this. Hank's been a difficult employee, to be honest. More interested in showing off than doing good work. He's aggressive. He starts shit with the other employees. He's often late for work and so on. So this came up and I figured maybe he's trying to turn things around. Even though I was reluctant, I wanted to give him a chance. Now I'm questioning if it was a good idea. I don't know. Maybe he got hit by pirates. Maybe he's out of fuel, drifting. Maybe he just stopped for chunks. Anyway, something's up, and it doesn't seem good. Since you've proven yourself so skilled in so many ways, I was hoping to call on you for it. So, you in? Yeah, why not? Oh, thanks. This is a huge help. Why not? You'll be happy to know I actually carved out some of the budget so I can pay you for all of your assistance. We don't currently have much information to go on. I'd suggest checking with Sidonia ship services over at the starport first. They'd be the last person I know that's seen Hank. It's all I've got without sending you all the way to Gagarin to retrace his steps. Good luck.
trouble, you let us know. Used to think I was Vanguard material. Until I discovered that space travel turns my stomach in knots. Keep on the straight and narrow. Don't let me keep you. Found a clutch of heat leeches, uh... Jaffa. Freestall, freestall. Docking cycle complete. Good Lord. Got it. Anything I can help you with? seen better days. I wonder if the UC will ever fully restore it to its former glory. We get the occasional drunken disorderly. How about my foot up your ass, newsboy? That a big enough scoop for you? I really don't think that's appropriate talk coming from a Vanguard pilot. That's exactly your problem. You don't think. If you weren't such a lousy reporter, you wouldn't be stuck all the way out here. I mean... I guess maybe that's true, but uh, if so, you're just as stuck out here as I am. So what does that say? Oh, wow! You really do want me to kick your ass, don't ya? All right, that's enough. Bastion, go cool off. Get a drink. Whatever. Fine. Holden, I appreciate that you have a job to do. I really do. But you need to consider that you don't operate in a vacuum. If you're stationed here long-term, that means you're around these people all day, every day. And they're not going to like it if you're making them look bad. Lieutenant Commander Marquez, I appreciate your concern, but I have an obligation to SSNN to report on what I see. I'm sure they do know that, Holden. I'm just saying, maybe use a little more discretion in your reporting. Maybe a lot. Don't worry. When the next big story breaks out here, I'll be sure to help you get the scoop, okay? I will think on that. Thank you. 
I should be grateful that things are so quiet here. But it just makes me uneasy. I really did Haven't this seen place. you around here before. Action. Welcome to the den. Reyna Marquez. I head up the Vanguard station here. If you've got business with the Vanguard, I hope you ran it through Mast first. If not, you probably made a long jump for nothing. Why, certainly. The Settled Systems News Network is the longest running news service in... Well, the Settled Systems. Goodbye, then. If you see anything unusual or illegal, make sure you report it. Vanguard's here for a reason. We'll take care of it. Oh, gosh, no. Vanguard wasn't even a thought back when this place was first built. The den, the original den, mind you, got blown up during the Serpent's Crusade. UC Navy immediately rebuilt the station, I think largely out of spite. Sometimes I think that's why they keep it operational, too. Certainly hasn't had much real purpose since the Colony War ended. I'm glad we have it as a post, and Marcel and the Trade Authority do some decent business, which I try very hard not to pay attention to. But the station has never recaptured that old glory. Don't think it ever will, really. The same thing we do everywhere else. Fill in the gaps for the UC Navy. Help keep the settled systems peaceful and safe. Sometimes it's a little bit of a challenge all the way out here, but we try our best. I wouldn't mind a little more support from New Atlantis, but I know things are tough all over. Might be counterintuitive, but no. No, we don't. It's pretty quiet, and some of us deal with that better than others. We get the occasional distress call. Sometimes Varun stirs up trouble, but there's a lot of downtime. I'm not complaining, but others, like Bastion there, it's not what he was expecting. Certainly not what he wanted. Fly safe. I think I might stop the stream here, guys, because I am slowly dying from not eating from yesterday. So I really need to get some food. Hi. Please. Disregard. But yeah, cheers for joining the stream, and we will see you soon. Love a time. Blah, 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 blah. Oh no. Oh no! How does one even stop? I can't stop, I'm, I'm stuck in this endless loop. That's what my life is now. Spawn die, spawn die, spawn die! I don't even know where the- oh, there it is. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Take care, guys.